Good morning, my name is Nancy Hoppe with Raising Dreamers Ministries. This week we wanna muse on marriage. Hebrews 13 verse four says, let marriage be held in honor among all. And so therefore we wanna know how can we be honorable in our marriages? How can I be an honorable wife and bring honor to the Lord? Well, we wanna do that by taking responsibility for the things that we can do. We can't change our husbands. We don't have perfect husbands. You're not a perfect wife. But let's see what scripture says about how we can have the right attitudes, okay? Ephesians 5, 19 through 22, we are seeing what the will of the Lord is, which is to be filled with the Spirit. So wives, what will be earmarks of being filled with the Spirit? Verse 19, speaking to one another in psalms and hymns and spiritual songs, singing and making melody with your heart to the Lord, always giving thanks for all things in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, to God, even the Father. Um, be subject to one another in the fear of Christ. And wives, be subject to your own husbands as to the Lord. So first, verse 19, a song comes out of our hearts. We are bringing worship out of our um, hearts and out of our mouths. And that is a way that we can be a wife who is filled with the Spirit. Secondly, being grateful, giving thanks always. And so hopefully it comes out of your mouth, specifically to your husband. Third, being subject to one another in the fear of Christ, that's a mutual respect. It is listening and understanding and just being a right friend. Lastly, wives, be subject to your own husbands as to the Lord. When you are yielding yourself to the Lord, then you're able to put yourself under the leadership of a husband. And you're able to do that knowing that he, God, will take care of you through the difficult things. Now, you have a great day. Let's be better wives than we were yesterday. And I'll see you tomorrow.